Well, the Summer Olympics in Tokyo will be here before we know it. And we know Michiana will be represented at the Games. 16 News Now sports reporter Megan Smelly brings you the story of a Buchanan grad who will ride the rings for Team USA. Last week, Hannah Roberts became the first American to qualify for Tokyo in BMX freestyle. Now the next goal is to get on the podium. If she gets there, she could be the youngest American cycling medalist since 1912. And she's more than ready for that challenge more than a century in the making. It's, it's legit my life. It's the only thing that I think about. For 10 years now, Hannah Roberts has poured blood, sweat, and tears into her riding. She grew up riding at the kitchen, owned by her cousin, former BMX pro Brett Banasewicz. I knew no matter what, I wanted to make it a career. But early on, Roberts suffered an injury that could have ended her career before it took off. I broke my back when I was 10. Even as a kid, Roberts was determined that this was the sport for her. I mean, I told my dad while I was still laying there, I was like, like I'm, I'm going to keep riding, and my mom's like, Freaking out, but it, it was it was something that the BMX community is like like nothing else. Like we always have each other's back, and and they're all so supportive. So um, just to see that, I was like, yeah, this is this is for me. And it is. At just 18 years old, she's already a two-time world champion. To see all that hard work pay off, and to have my you know my my favorite people around me was was like unlike anything else. And I was I'm super blessed that they were all there. And she really needs that support network. Hannah's training to become an Olympian is no joke. She rides for five hours a day, six days a week. Hits the gym for two hours a day, three days a week. Then there's cardio every morning. Oh, and that's just the physical training. When I'm not riding, I watch videos of myself or other people riding just to see ways that I can get better and ways that I could change and, and do more. Um, so it is a full-time job and, and it's it's everything to me. Now Roberts hopes to take her talents to new heights, reaching for the gold in the red, white, and blue. Just to wear a USA on my chest, um, no matter what, it's just a huge honor, but um, showing it off on, on the Olympic stage, on, on the biggest sports stage in the world is, is like, it's everything that I've dreamed about. I mean, I've always wanted to go to the Olympics. To wear it, to actually, like, accomplish a dream is, is something that you can't even describe. It's, it's going to be crazy. BMX race has been in the game since 2008, centered around speed on a racetrack. But this summer in Tokyo, Hannah's event, BMX Freestyle, will make its Olympics debut. For us, it's, uh, you know, a minute run, we do whatever we want trick-wise and try to use the course. So you, there is a lot more freedom and it's not just about speed, it's about speed and style and height and tricks and everything like that. In April, Roberts heads to Tokyo for a test event and gets to see the course for the first time. After that, she'll train in North Carolina with the rest of Team USA on a custom-made course to match that Olympic one. She's on the brink of history on the world stage, but isn't forgetting her roots. Buchanan's so small, and and not a lot of people know, you know, where Southwest Michigan is, where South Bend is, where Buchanan is. So just to be, just to have a chance to, you know, put it on the map, bring people's attention to it, is is awesome. And obviously, uh, to get people, more people here riding, and and to support the park that helped me get to where I was uh, or where I am, um, just means the world to me. It's awesome. Oh, it was fun. The Tokyo Olympics are still five and a half months away, but Hannah Roberts is thinking even further ahead. She says she still wants to be competing when the 2028 Olympics come home to the USA in Los Angeles. In the studio, Megan Smedley for 16 News Now. How cool is that? Wow, and she's good. She's really good. Wow. Yeah, of course, 16 News Now is your official home of the 2020 Summer Olympics in Tokyo, so you could catch Hannah's quest for the gold right here this summer.